Hey, this is Shabbitz, and we are in Sushi Factory Tycoon on Roblox. And I am at Alloy's place, my nephew. And he is liking this game, and I like it a lot too. I'm, I had a lot of fun before, and, and since he just started playing it, I started playing it too again. Hey, what's all this? Looks like somebody's leftover stuff. But anyway, yeah, so he's this is his base, or his restaurant, I should say. Oh, he's already got the upper floor? Oh, nice. He's got some badges going. Cool. Yeah, this game goes fast, but it's got a, like, a lot of playability. I'll drive over to my base. Oh, wait. He's the star of the show today. Hi, Josh. Okay. So this one I'm going to say is I think is really fun. Besides, it's a cool tycoon, and stuff is happening all the time. There's my all my uh, sushi coming out of the droppers over there. Though I don't know what happened. I thought I used to be able to ride this around. When I was trying yesterday, I kept falling through the world, so I'm not going to mess with that right now. But anyway, you can, like, you know, your little customers come in. And the nice thing is, I like about this one thing right away, is they'll go sit down, and if I want to go visit him or go fishing and do other things, they, you know, they don't. there's no angry customer stuff. They're just ready when you are. So he wants a spicy vegetable roll. And so they just do that. And then sometimes they'll ask for a coffee. Sometimes they'll ask for soy sauce with their meal. I think you only pick up, oh no, you can pick up a little bit of everything. Wasabi. And like he had, I have a little uh, place up here with the badges you can get for doing different tasks in the game. Some soy sauce, huh? Sure. You are welcome, sir. I mean, uh, Oni, Demon. Ooh, Alaska. Okay, so that reminds me. So these, there's your customers. Well, this is the really cool thing about this game. There's this whole... Well, let me just show you instead of trying to think of the right word. I'm going to press roll next. See? I just made a sushi roll with tuna. A simple sushi roll. And then it has the menu. It keeps track of all the different things you make. So let's make an opposite one the same way, but put the rice on the outside, which is a nori roll, I think. Tuna. And then you can do even more complicated things. Like let's put, you know, the basic down, but let's do vegetables. Every vegetable, I, oh, except for that one doesn't want to go. What about this one? No, it doesn't want my seaweed. All right, let's do this one. All right, so that was a chili, carrot, cucumber, vegetable roll. Now, so check out all the stuff I made just by experimenting and playing with the uh, different recipes. Alaskan roll, cucumber roll. I made a, one with shrimp, so that's a tiger roll. And look at all these cool Philadelphia ones I made. Nori rice tuna, nori rice cream cheese, nori rice salmon, shrimp. Shrimp. <laughs> so this part of the game I love. I could, That's why I have so many recipes because I'm always experimenting. And earlier I kept trying to mess with the... Uh... Actually, I like making the reverse ones better. With this stuff. But I had to like scroll up and hold it and then tap it for the crispy seaweed because I couldn't make it work earlier and I thought I was messing up. But anyway, no, no shrimp on that one. Oh, no, cream cheese. What am I thinking? So I, sometimes I try to think for real. It's like, you know, instead of just trying everything, think, what would I really want on this? So because I hadn't, I'd only made two recipes with the crispy um, 
seaweed, I was able to like discover these new um, recipes with that. So even for as long as I've been playing this game, I think I've unlocked like everything you can buy. So I'm just like making money, rolling it in. But that part of it, that part of it was a lot of fun. And it's still fun because like I said, he's playing now. And I want to show one other thing about this game. You get you can save your progress. So you want to make sure you save your progress before you leave. And he unfortunately yesterday was playing. He had his tycoon, like he's playing whatever. He had it going for a little while, maybe an hour. Well, anyway, he lee he goes, okay, bye, bye. And he leaves. And comes back in, and I thought to myself after he left, I go, did he save? Well, he comes back in and goes, oh, I forgot to save. So he comes in here and goes through and claims the tycoon. And I think he hit new instead of load. So it like a new game appears, and I just watch it just happen. Then he walked over and he stepped on the save button. And I was like, oh, no. And then he realized what he did. and But he just came right back because this game is like so fun. And plus, most tycoons don't save, so he's used to it anyway. And um, so, yeah, there's other people in different states of development here. There's somebody just started their first story. Oops, I don't want to violate their space. And here's somebody else has a nice two-story thing going without the roof yet but they'll get there oh yeah you can go fishing to get shrimp and crab for your recipes so that's how i had all those extra items oh yeah so this is one way you go fishing let's see what we get a nice crab and you also can go fishing over on this island and it as you get more customers in your store that's whoa nice 111 so you can go fishing here to catch some other kinds of things. There's a vegetable garden. So you saw how I had carrots and um, cucumbers. Did I get any daikon there? So that all these different things, like the little fishing place, if you get, I think, five customers, that unlocks that. This was like 30 customers or something, 35. And you can unlock this vegetable garden. Some chili peppers. Oh, I think this is the crispy. Oh, no, that. Never mind. Forget I even said that. Cream cheese. So, yeah, there's a lot to offer in this tycoon, and it saves, which I love. I love tycoons that save. Okay, I'm going to end this here and talk to him on the phone for a little while. All right, I'm going to go out to the title screen. Am I? Yeah, I do need to. To show this game. Let's got to make sure I got the name right. Sushi Factory Tycoon. Give it a try. It is a super fun tycoon. Thanks, Alloy231. Thanks for watching.